Oh yeah, yeah, by the way, that's another big reason. Vicky let take some box and she abuses her Adderall prescription. She smokes weed and she smokes weed with her kids. And she does steroids. I don't know if they do them anymore, but they used to cycle them on and off. She shot up steroids. So that's the box and abuse Adderall so it counts. And Adderall is methamphetamine, by the way. So the box and Adderall pot and steroids. Oh, I told y'all, if you if you took the Bible, if you knew anything about the Bible, you took it seriously. God is living in in this. If you judge anyone for anything, God is making you a hypocrite. If you judge, you do the same thing. If you judge, you do the same thing. So, God's gonna. That's karma. It's like another form of karma, I guess you'd say. It's like a judgmental form of karma. If you judge anyone for anything, God's going to do the same to you. So, it's like, okay, the point I'm making though, Vicky let lied to put me in jail. She was the one who made the actual call, and she lied to get me put in jail. She told about seven lies. Like, she just said anything that was going to get get that officer to get me put in jail. And she said that she did it for my best interest. Well, I'm going to try to say things that make you commit suicide for your best interest, Eden. You do a total of four drugs. You smoke weed with your kids when they were minors. I hope that me putting your ass on blast like that gets Ethan taken away from you because y'all are bad parents and Ethan doesn't need to be under y'all's influence. Also, another reason is because Vicky Led is extremely kind to her kids. More than right, and, and everybody knows, like, it's, you can ask Kobe Robinson. You could ask Diedrich if he wasn't a bitch, but he knows. It's like, De uh, Dad and Vicky, like, abused, abused me and Jacob. But they were super duper nice to Morgan and Riley. Like, Vicky and Dad. Dad just didn't fuck with Morgan and Riley because he didn't want no problems out of Vicky. But Vicky was super duper hard on me and Jacob. Super hard. Super hard. And then, Vicky, remember that day you slapped Jacob for touching Ethan? You bitch slapped Jacob for touching Ethan? Well, hey, that just shows the double standard. You didn't give a fuck about me and Jacob. You give a fuck about your kids. Me and Jacob were just like the little nigger boys. You bitch slapped Jacob, and then you made me cry for standing up for you slapping Jacob. You made me cry for standing up for you slapping Jacob. It's kind of more of a story. If I if I get to, if I just sit out here on Earth and I got like free range, I'm gonna torment you, Vicky. Yet again, you did four drugs and then lie <clears throat> lied on me about doing one. And then the only reason why they took your word for it, like why Vicky's so good with the people at the police station, is because she used to fuck them. She used to fuck them. She used to fuck them. Nobody knows that because Dad and Vicky's done cheated on each other like ten times. They go back and forth. That's why Vicky and Dad were getting a fight and then Vicky would take it out on me. Because I was the oldest and I looked like Dad. She'd take it out on me. That's fine. We're going to see how it sits in your conscience. I hope y'all love me just enough where like, it, it fucks your life up. Get it in. I just I want you to know it's your fault. How you treated me. Vicky, this is your fault. 